Hello. I can remember when I had that false message from my CEO. I was on leave. He rang me and he's like, oh, this is Lieutenant Colonel Foster. I'm like, okay, what have I done wrong? So it's like, why is the Colonel calling me? It's like, yeah, congratulations. I mean, you've won this award. My first computer was given to me by my uncle and all I used to do was just open it apart and play with it. I went on to do a HND in computing and IT. Um, after that I wanted to join the Royal Signals but I couldn't. I joined the Royal Artillery. So I had to wait five years before I could join the Royal Signals to actually do what I wanted to do. Even though in the Royal Artillery you get to do basics but then that was building up my skills and then I thought, you know, I think I'm ready to go into the next step. The real signals of being in there is a whole wall out there that I can do whatever I want in regards to IT and cyber. These devices that we're using can be, can be detrimental to our day-to-day -day jobs. For example, our smartwatches, they're on Bluetooth. In these sensitive areas, this is the reason why it's against army policy, why you can't use it. So with the Cyberland, we were able to use it, do experiment on it. This is something that I volunteered to do in my own time. I started this cyber team, just helping people around me, but I didn't think it was going to be this big. I am over the moon and humbled by it, truly humbled by it. If you could tell 13-year-old self anything, yeah. What, what do you think you'd say to him? I would say, follow your dream, yeah? Never give up, keep pushing, or one day you might just get there. Thanks for watching. For more from Forces News, like and subscribe to our channel.